Hi, darlings. It's Robin here. Thanks for joining me for your Tuesday, December 27th daily tarot card reading. I will be using the Starman tarot card deck to do this reading for you guys. So let me just clear out the energy, okay? Um, I just want to literally clear the deck, okay? And I'll start shuffling here. Just want to get a really good energy and a really good vibe. Uh, yesterday's reading was a little bit troublesome because we're seeing somebody that you were giving your power away to. We don't ever want that to happen under any circumstances. So hopefully you were able to flush that out of your system and we'll see what's going on for you today. All right, so let me just pull a card. We do have the judgment card here for you guys. So it does look like you were very successful in separating out the past from the present and pushing things to the side so that you can sort of stand there and beat your chest and be as powerful as you can be, okay? So I think this is a really beautiful card to start off with for you guys, just really reclaiming your power and saying nobody's standing in my way today. And that's, that's how it should be every day. And I'm just gonna pull another card from the top of the deck. You've got the Ace of Pentacles. So really digging deep and maybe touching on a very um, disconcerting memory that was oozing into your present mind state. That has flipped a switch in you where you have reclaimed your power and you're able to bring in things because the Ace of Pentacles represents as above, so below, right? So as above, so below, I was doing it off camera. But anyway, um, if your root system isn't very strong, and we saw that yesterday by this person that sort of resembled um, an antagonist from your past, and that really shook you, okay? So you have to get all these things, like get your ducks in a row, really, so that you feel very strong, not just above the surface, but below it, okay? So it looked like there was a little bit of work that needed to be done. And this is nothing but power coming in for you today. So this is a really, really nice recovery. I think another really important message in this reading as compared to yesterday is that your healing can happen that quickly. You just have to take control of it, okay? Um, and this is going to take a little bit of self-discipline, meditation, whatever it is. Um, if forgiving other people is right up there, okay? So if there was that somebody from yesterday's reading, that King of Wands energy, and you're holding a grudge against them, that's just going to harm you because they're not even going to know about it. They probably don't even care. So it's time to really release that as we move into the new year, okay? It's going to be super, super important for you. You do have the High Priestess, so there's a very huge sort of calming divine feminine energy around you today. Um, <clears throat> okay, so I'm getting suggestions of your ancestry being very close to you today. So if you're still not in a place where you're feeling as powerful as this judgment card, you know, where you can just blast things to the side and stand there and say, I'm using my own energy to heal myself, to create a better life for myself, to create wealth. Um, if you're not feeling stable today, even if you are, like really tap into, this is the energy of your great, 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 great grandmothers, you know, these are the women that would, they would just keep everything going just by the pure spirit of them, the drive. This is the passion of your great, great, great grandmothers coming in and bolstering you up. They don't want you to have another, well, that was an okay year, you know, they don't want you to have another lackluster love affair. They don't want you to sit through another crappy job that you can't stand, but you need the money. They don't want you to feel less than. They want you to feel as empowered as everybody else. So you can be this ace of pentacles energy and just create the life that you want. Okay, so this was kind of a deep one, but you're in for a nice recovery, especially if you can remember the prayers and the potions of the women that walked before you. Okay, let's see what happens Dragon Day. Bye. <laughs>